currency depreciation, does that hinder or does that help the case for Southeast Asian markets, James? Uh, well, I think at this stage, what's important, of course, is the global outlook. So, of course, with a slowing um, economic environment globally, the demand for uh, goods would, would fall. Uh, so of course, a depreciating currency helps, but you don't want it to depreciate so much. So, I, I think what's happening with uh, central banks in ASEAN and Asia is actually to uh, sort of uh, increase interest rates in lockstep with what's happening with the Federal Reserve so that you kind of uh, have some stability in the currency in that sense so that they could, uh, in fact, uh, kind of, um, in a way, prevent inflation from building up in the system but also to kind of keep their currency in a more stable mode. How then should we uh, position as investors, James, uh, in this environment? Because what we've been, been hearing all along and the consensus view seems to be you've got to play defence, especially when short-duration bonds are giving you such a compelling yield when stacked against uh, the dividend yield that you can get in the S&P uh, 500. What does that strategy then look like when you lay it over the Southeast Asian markets? Well, I think in Southeast Asia, it, uh, Southeast Asian markets have been actually fairly uh, resilient uh, this year. Mm. Uh, and I think earlier part of the year, we were a bit more bullish on it. But since then, we have been a bit more nuanced in where we think the winners would be. Uh, currently, I think we are neutral in most Southeast Asian countries. But we actually like uh, Thailand, for example, because of reopening, because of tourism. And we think that there are actually selective opportunities uh, there. But of course, uh, within Southeast Asia, you also have uh, REITs play in Singapore. You also have uh, a lot of quality companies that uh, investors can actually uh, observe. But of course, at this stage, uh, it's going to be volatile. It's going to be uncertain. But clearly, uh, there will be also some uh, pockets of opportunities. Got it. Mandy? 